Now in this question, number 8, we're given the two particles P and Q with masses 2 kilograms and 3 kilograms and they're tied together by the string here that is taut, it's light, inextensible and we have this forward force acting on Q which is called F and it's of 30 newtons. And the particles start off at rest, so I want to add this to the diagram by showing this by drawing a little arrow here saying that it started at rest, 0 meters per second, and then due to this force the particles move to the right and then after 3 seconds, let's just say when t equals 3, okay, the particle q is say over here, alright? it's moved a distance of 6 meters. Okay, so just put that in like that. And what we've got to do is find out the acceleration over this particular section. So I'm marking the acceleration that way as A meters per second per second. Now this is a typical SUVAT type of question. So for part A, okay, what we have got is that we can use S equals UT plus a half AT squared because we have S which represents the displacement which will be 6 meters, so you can pop that in there, 6 equals U, the initial velocity which was 0 so zero times anything, that's just going to be simply zero, so I can leave that out. And then we've got half times the acceleration A, which is what we're trying to find, multiplied by the time squared, and the time was three seconds, so that's going to be three squared. If I multiply now through by two, we've got that six times two is twelve, gives 3 squared times a, in other words 9a. Dividing by 9 to both sides gives 12 over 9 equals a, and 12 ninths reduces down to 4 thirds, so the acceleration is 4 thirds of a meter per second per second. And that brings us to the end then of part a.